Hey everybody, what's going on? Vion here with a good old fashioned update for the banner. So, this week's new suit is full armor Gundam ground type. It is actually a 450 general type. It's a two star rarity. Um, it definitely seems interesting. Uh, the next thing we have is a step up, well not step up, excuse me, a regular banner with Pell Rider with ground heavy arms and space type each with level three which is actually pretty dope. I think those are the new levels um, if you have not also seen it they all the devs have released an update um, regarding what they want to do the map changes should be live now on various maps including some space matches where debris actually moves so yes we, we, we know this is how things we do anyway so, for the DP shop, our new suit is Galbaldi Alpha. That's actually very quick. Um, in terms of... There we go. Thought so. In terms of that, we have the anti-beam armor. Ooh, 200k. Oh, man. The anti-armor is 200k a piece. That's, that's a hefty price right there. As far as new stuff goes and weapons, nothing's there popping up for us. Recycle counter. This is a good chance to get the GM intercept custom or the bishop. Bishop's a very strong support support suit in space. While the um, intercept custom full um, is actually pretty pretty pretty. I was supposed to say full boost. Uh, it's actually a pretty handy general suit. Keep an eye out. Ooh, strength and frame 200, but that's still that's a lot. Um, 1,200. Also, they did announce that there will be an ongoing, an actual on, ongoing campaign every month. It was, it's going to be interesting. But anyway, um, this update, the map variation of port base early morning has been added. Um, you'll probably start to see this in rotation. I'm curious to see if it's here now. Yeah, I'm right here. Port base during the day. So it's really neat. Um, the the shuttles actually fly sometimes during the match, so we're probably going to jump into that here soon. Um, mountain area had some stuff change. The space had some other things change. Um, and they changed the rival system where whoever has a total score will actually wins rather than, you know, feeling like you did a great job uh, all around. Coming first, second place, you still get beat by a rival somehow. So they definitely did that. Make sure you check the website for more details and information. Um, there was Battle Operation Base Camp and Nakano. Um, it's really cool. It sounds like something they're doing in February where people can go play Gun Battle Operation 2 for free um, and kind of meet other people. Um, so that's the 26th, in, in 26th of February, 25th of March, and 22nd of April. That's really, really cool. I really like that. That's really neat. I wish we had stuff like that around here. But the first Sunday no the first Thursday every Sunday will also be called battle operation day and various campaigns be implemented um, it's a special day during which each month from about two o'clock to five the following Monday a special campaign is held um, recruits and returning soldiers as well as pilots who are always on sortie will benefit from campaigns says the website the first one will start Thursday February 6th um, like for one they said you can get like free lottery dis uh, distribution um, you know three star mobile suit may be confirmed so it's actually pretty cool uh, just keep an eye out for more information regarding that um, there is a Twitter campaign if you follow the official account and retweet you may receive a gift but again that's probably that's probably Japanese residents only unfortunately but yeah Hopefully you guys get into some good good matches on the new map. Good luck on anyone who's going for the Pell Rider. I actually don't have the space type. I'm really tempted to try it. I am a fan of that journal type, but also I want to get my hands on this bad boy right here. So hopefully we can do that, and we'll see. That being said, I hope you guys have a great day. Good luck on your pools. Peace.